Today I'm going to go over how to create your own Amazon skill. Now this is going to be a lot easier than most people think. Uh, the first things that you're going to need to have is one, you're going to need to have an Alexa. Two, you're going to be able to need to log into the Alexa app. And then number three, you're going to get started here on blueprints.amazon.com. This is going to be kind of your home base uh, to be able to create these skills. So once you log in, um, and you log in just like your Alexa app, it's going to take you to this screen right here. This screen right here, you'll see there's a bunch of different skills that you can create. Um, personal trainer, whose turn, so on and so on. Um, where we're going to go today is going to be the learning and knowledge tab. But you'll also see there's a bunch of different things you can do, birthday trivia, so on and so on. Um, but here we go. We're going to get started with the quiz. Now, what's nice about this is you can create your own personalized quiz. Um, you can have up to four players on here. It's going to ask you the question, going to let you know if it's right or wrong. And then it's going to follow up with a fun fact. And at the end, let you know who the winner is. Um, so great for parties, great for learning with kids. I really think this is going to be the future of studying. Um, I think you'll see kids using it a lot. So we'll get started and we'll make our own. And the first section here is going to be the content. So what questions are we going to ask? What's the answer? And then what's the fun fact? So how the game would work is she'd ask the question. And they're not going to go in order. Um, you'll see we have you know, five questions here, but you can always add more. And she's going to ask the question. You're going to answer right or wrong. She's going to let you know. And then she's going to follow up with a fun fact. And the one I decided to go with today is going to be the capitals. So I'm going to go in and fill this content with the capitals. And we're going to make a capital quiz. So let's get started. And I'll just show you an example of one. And then I'll just kind of fast forward and fill out the rest. So what is the capital of Alabama? It is going to be Montgomery. So we're going to put that in there. And then once we get that in there, we're going to follow up with a fun fact. And I don't have a fun fact, so I'm going to make one up. So Montgomery has a population of 50,000 people. And if you're from Montgomery, I'm sorry, I don't know uh, if that's the right answer, but I'm just putting this in here as an example. So I'm going to go in here, fill out the rest, and then I'm going to move over to the Experience tab. So I went ahead and added in the states and the capitals here, as you can see, and I'm going to move on to the Experience tab now. Now for the Experience tab, you could just skip right through this and be okay. Um, their default settings are already already pretty good. Um, they have a quiz intro, so when you enter the quiz, it'll say a response. Um, you can get customizable with that, which can be fun. At player greetings, um, I think this is pretty a pretty fun feature. Um, if you answer it correctly, you could do like a crowd cheer. Um, you can do certain bells. Great job, good job. And then, of course, if you get it wrong, um, you can do a crowd boo. I'll let you hear what that sounds like. It's pretty funny. So we'll go to that. Oops, clicked the wrong button. <laughs> I love that one. So that one's fun. Uh, if you want to be nice, you don't have to add that one in there. Um, but then down here, the last thing you're going to get is, of course, the winner's response. Uh, they're the best, they're awesome, you know, whatever you want to put in there. And then lastly, it's going to be the background image. Um, so if you have a show, it's just what we'll display in the background. And like I said before, these are all good, so you can pretty much skip through this if you really wanted to once you get the content in. And then lastly, um, you're going to click uh, Next. You're going to name it. So we'll do Capital Quiz. Um, well, we'll do State Capital Quiz so we know which quiz it is. State Capital Quiz, and we'll create the skill. It typically takes about one to two minutes um, to create the skill. So pretty quick. Uh, you'll see here, um, it gives you, uh, you can set it up on free time if you have that setting available. Um, that's always nice. But you'll also be able to share it too. So 
after this two minutes is complete, um, you'll be able to share it through email, um, text, um, however you want to share it. Um, but you'll see the visibility as well as just for you. If you want to publish it, um, it'll also leave that option for you as well. I'll tell you, I've published a couple. Um, it can take a month or two months uh, to get it passed through Amazon. So just a heads up if you want to do that. Uh, but this is how you set up a skill for the Amazon Alexa. Very simple. Have fun. If you have any questions, uh, definitely leave it in the comments. And uh, please subscribe and check out more of the videos about setting up these Alexa skills and some of the smart home things we can do. Thank you.